Hey guys, what we have here is an iPhone 8 that used to have the unable to activate error. I'm sure you've seen this over the past couple of years where the iPhone 7s and 8s will suddenly lose the signal. If you try to reset the phone, it says unable to activate because the activation data cannot be read from the phone. The only way to fix this was to either send it back to Apple if it's eligible to be repaired under warranty or to do a hardware fix, uh, basically resolder the baseband back on the phone. Uh, this is a phone that I've had for probably a year now. I just kept it around because I figured either somebody would buy it, which they didn't, or I could find a way around it. Now that we have the ability to bypass the setup screen using the iCloud bypass check rain method, this also works for unable to activate phones. Now I've already done the bypass and I'll link the, the bypass instructions below, but this is how you can see that this is a, a phone basically that has no IMEI. See it says cellular update failed. Okay. Also my home button's missing, but disregard that. If you go to general about see the IMEI is missing. It's really weird. But that's okay. Um, we can use this phone still for apps and Wi-Fi. A camera. It's an iPhone 8, so the camera's pretty good. Uh, you could still make phone calls over the internet, say WhatsApp or something like that. So if you have an iPhone that has unable to activate error message and won't let you get to the home screen, you can use the iCloud bypass method to make it operational again. just working fine and uh, it'll just be kind of like an iPod now all right thanks for watching also for more iPhone bypass tips visit iphonesavage.com